I'm Stuart Mogg. I play for the Basingstoke Bison. Uh, I'm classed as a utility player because I play both forward and defence. So previous seasons, basically, two seasons ago we won the EPL Cup and the playoffs. Two seasons for me that weren't probably the best. So I didn't put up many points and I wasn't that much of a contributor for the team. But still, I won most improved player both years. So I've always been on the rise, like trying to get better and better each season. Uh, throughout like summers and stuff, I've put in like a lot of hard work in like the gym and on the ice. So a couple of years ago, I was pretty, well, very overweight. And uh, from there, I've lost a couple of stone and it's really started to help my performance. The Peterborough game tonight, uh, it's basically we're one point ahead of them. And if we win tonight, we'll be three points clear of them. And they won't, they'll only have a game in hand. So even if they win, we'll still be in the lead. So basically, it's the most important game of the season so far. So we can break away and hopefully start to build up a lead at the top of the league. Um, being the team captain, uh, I've got a lot of weight on my shoulders tonight. I need to do uh, good for the players, um, good for myself and good for the coach. Um, it's a big game we've got tonight, so uh, we're going to need to nail it, um, but we will. We've been training really hard three days a week, um, Yeah, and we're going to be going through the ice. The team as a whole, we've got a great team, like a great bunch of guys. It's um, like I couldn't ask to be in a better team. Like the management and everything, the like off ice staff are amazing. As uh, Bisons are the best team, uh, we like to be the best dressed. Um, all the lads get suit and beard. Uh, it is tradition, we have done it for all the years we have been a team. Um, so we're going to arrive in style just to uh, let them players know that. We're going to be beating them tonight. We get to decide where the cup game uh, will be played, what date and what time. So it's really important for us. Um, so we're going to do a really, really good job today. Just about to take Jack to the match. Let's do this. You ready? Yeah, man. Let's do this. Woo! Let's do this. We've got a great, uh, solid core of fans as well. We get over a thousand fans at each of our games, so. We've always got a really good atmosphere, a lot of chanting. It really keeps like the buzz going. Uh, so far, undefeated at home this season. I think it's maybe 15 games now, which is a record for the club too. So like, it's, we're we'll doing anything to keep that going. I've been a Bison fan for about two, nearly three years. I got into ice hockey because my housemate moved into Hall's Stuart Mogg and he played for the Bisons and he told me and all of our flat all about it and I actually really got into it. So I went started going to a couple of games and since then I've been a bit hooked and I try and go pretty much every week.
basically from the weekend pretty gutted about the uh, loss to Peterborough, 3-2 loss. Um, the game started out pretty well for the first two periods, like coming off the like ice after the second period, we were in a good spot, we were 2-1 up. Uh, felt confident going into third as it's normally one of our strongest periods, but I guess it just wasn't meant to be, like a couple of bounces didn't go our way, we got quite a lot of penalties which we kind of put down to what could have been one of our major factors for losing because we put like we put in the effort but I guess in the end like we didn't do what was needed to win. As soon as the game finished you could sense the whole everyone was there everyone there just dropped and usually after a game there's a buzz of everyone leaving and everyone goes up for drinks and we all hung out and it's a, a laugh and everyone still was there to support the guys but I mean they you could tell they were all devastated and everyone was gutted at, at the loss it was a massive uh, down for us considering we've been on such a high for so so long this season um, but it just gives us a chance to bring it back and gives us something to play for now. It was the first loss that we've had all season so it was a massive hit for all of us and I know a hit for the team, but after their loss the other day, I know it's going to be 10 times worse for the boys. Um, the aggression is obviously really strong in the sport. And so tonight, I think they'll all be taking their anger out on each other. So they're all going to have a few bruises, I think, when they come home. So, our practice today was a tough practice. Did a lot of skating, a lot of drills that involve skating like the full length of the ice. So basically we can get a like, really good workout in for the weekend coming up. I had a pretty good game personally, so I mean I wasn't on for any of our goals forward, but I wasn't on for any against, so I see myself as having a very solid like defensive game, which for me at the moment playing in defence is pretty crucial. I see that as the most important thing that I want to keep doing.